All right, uh, so today I'm going to show you how to make a UV gradient, how to color a building using a gradient. Okay, so here I have a tower. So just to show you here, I'm going to create another object. So let's just use a cube like so, or you can just like this. And just for this purpose, I'm going to scale it on the Z axis by three. Okay, so apply this transform. Open the UV editing, focus it three to have a side view of it. Then select all the vertices with A and project from view. Okay, here on the UV uh, image, scale it just to fill the, the image on the Y axis. Okay, perfect. After that, you can select your object, file, export fbx so now i should have okay so here in unity back in unity i have my cube here okay boom 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 perfect so here you can see that it's not rotated well so just to fix that i'm going to re-export the file and here you should apply the transform all right selected object perfect so now it's zero 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 on the rotation and one on the scale all right, so now I'm gonna give this cube the tower material too. Okay, perfect. And now I'm gonna create a new shader. So let's create shader, uh, universal render pipeline, lit shader graph. And let's call it UV gradient. Okay, perfect. Let's open it. So first, you're gonna need a top color top color. You're going to need also a bottom color. All right, perfect. And yeah, for the moment, that, uh, that's going to be it. So let's drag this here. And we are going to use a lerp node to interpolate between these two colors. So we are going to interpolate between the bottom color and the top color. Regarding the T value, we are going to use the UV Y axis. So let's grab our UV node, split it, mm -hmm. and use the G component, the G value. So the G uh, corresponds to the, um, the Y axis. Okay, perfect. From here, we can drag it and drop it into the base color. So let's save that. And we are going to apply our UV shader to the tower material. Okay, so now you can see if I select the... Oh! <laughs> That's in the other, that's the other way around actually. Okay, so let's take the top color and here and okay, and drag this and drop it here. Save as it. Oh, no, 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 that was it. I'm sorry. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so top color red, bottom color white, and here we go. You've got a really nice gradient here. Awesome.